Charles Bukowski. His solution for everything was drinking. But since I've had this stroke that drinking's been ruled out for me. Bukowski would say that if you're feeling depressed, just uh, get yourself a bottle of whiskey and go to bed for three days. Sleep it off. Perhaps it worked. <laughs> but it's not a advice that I would give to anybody. But uh, he was a drinker and a half. The Irish as well. Perhaps drown their sorrows in drink. Scottish. Finnish, Russians, they've all got their special drinks, whiskey or Guinness or vodka. But it's no solution. But it's good for a drinking song or a drinking poet. When things go wrong, but will not go right, though you do the best you can. When life seems dark as the hour of night, and a pint of plain is your only man. When money's tight, and it's hard to get, and your horses are also runs, and all you have is a heap of debt, and a paint a plain is your only man. When your health is bad and your heart feels strange and your face is pale and wan. When your doctor says that you need a change then a paint of pale is your only man. When food is scarce and the larder's bare and no rashers will grease your pan when hunger grows cause your meals are rare and a pint of plain is your only man. In times of trouble and lousy strife though you still have a darling plan you can still turn to a better life because a pint of plain is your only man. So that was a poem by Flan O'Brien who wrote The Third Policeman. I remember reading The Third Policeman and the amazing atomic theory. <laughs> do you want to know about the amazing atomic theory? It was a theory that uh, people could become half man, half bicycle on the rocky roads of Ireland that uh, policemen and uh, postmen were rumbling along the roads and uh, the molecules and atoms from the bicycle shot up into the man and quite similarly the molecules from the man shot down into the bicycle. So there was an exchange of atoms so that uh, the men became half men, half bicycles. And this is why you would see them uh, standing with their elbow against the wall in Irish streets or with one full foot up on the curbstone just like the pedal and the bicycle to support it because they turn into half bicycles so be careful <laughs> be careful if you're riding on bumpy roads on your bicycle it might have disastrous consequences. <laughs>